Life is like a box of chocolates, guys, right? Well, for Chef Bennett, life is all that and a bag of truffles. So here on this fabulous edition of Foodie Friday, I headed over to Classic Cake of Cherry Hill and learned how to make these beautiful truffles. Now these may look gorgeous, but it turns out they're really simple to make. First we're going to boil the cream, then we're going to pour it over top of our bittersweet chocolate, and then we have a ganache. Yeah, how do you make ganache? Good. What's in the ganache? You what know, can you not ask me shit? I don't know. <sighs> <laughs> Just so there's context here, the versatility of our table is very important. The, this yes. is the former hot dog table former for the hot last dog table. Friday. It also and was it, the hoagie table. It was also the hoagie table, exactly. For these truffles that I made, notice they're the ones that are just the big balls. <laughs> no, I'm thinking about the hot dogs. Wait, we have ones here that you made? I made these big you balls. You made those? Yes. Uh, you know what? I could, I could figure that out. But right? those are actually the most popular kind. Right. Number one, boil the cream. Number two, pour the boiled cream over the chocolate and mix it all up. Number three, cool down the mixture by pouring it on a cold slab. Now this was really cool because he was mixing them around with a tool he actually gets at Home Depot. This isn't like the cheap compound chocolates that you buy. At E.C. Moore and places yes. like that. You just melt them and they set up. I mean, those are good in a pinch, but this, this is the real thing. And that's how I made my friend's lollipops for a bridal shower, so shh. Then you prepare a cool ball of ganache for the center. My favorite part was actually enrobing. Not only is the word <laughs> right. fun to say, yeah, right. but you mix, you take a bunch of melted chocolate and you roll the balls in your hands. Really? Yes. Yeah, but with gloves on, with gloves on, guys. Uh, I, They're look, sanitary. Just, you know, point it out. And then, of course, All you right. cool them off, and the best right. part, eating. Yes! Whoa. These are the vanilla Tahitian caramel, which are my favorite. Oh, They're my super favorite, good. Sure. We have the milk chocolate and then dark chocolate. All right. Mm -hmm. Everything looks so amazing. Whoa. Fun fact, Chef Bennett, at the age of just 21, was President Reagan's pastry chef. I knew I liked this guy. I was under the impression that candy was very difficult to make because of the temperature Ooh. and the heat. I mean, this was super simple. I couldn't believe it. Super simple. The Really, the hardest part is just waiting for it to cool because you just want to eat. Mm. That is to die for. Mm -hmm. Is the Liberty Bell edible? It's edible. Wait, wait. Can somebody pass me the bell? I had this one. What is this one? Vanilla Tahitian caramel. What was this one? Does it got a crack in it? All right, ready? It does have a crack in it.